Well, hey there, good morning, everybody. Jen Crafasi, Jekyll Bates, and this is your workshop update. So, if you're viewing this today, which would be, let's see, it's Wednesday, I believe today's date is September 26th, that would mean that yesterday I did the, uh, the workshop and the spray session on this June book. So, I just wanted to show you what this little guy looks like. Bright and shiny, just came off the clear coat, getting shipped out this morning, super, super cool, love this pattern. You've got that light blue fade to the dark blue. It's patterned. You've got that white. It's You can obviously see that it's very translucent and clear underneath, which is exactly what we wanted it to do. This bait is going to be really good in the fall. Just 100% happy with the way it came out. We did two of those on camera yesterday. And uh, I love the ideas you guys give me. So if you have ideas that you want me to paint or things that you would like to learn, leave me a comment below in this section. Now these are little reef runners. These are going to upstate New York. And a craw pattern. This is the uh, pink bellied blue ice craw. I think it'll be a good winter bait. Definitely gonna be a knockdown, drag out, small mouth and walleye bait for the fall. And they just, they have a lot of success with this up there. And blue is a good color this time of year and year round, really. So Don's getting three of these. And these just came off the clear coat rack, so they need to be dressed and finished. But just very cool, very cool little crawl pattern. And let's see, we'll finish it up with this. This is that new peacock that I'm doing, which I mean, I guess you can call it a peacock. It really is a peacock pattern in the red and yellow, but it also mimics a craw pattern as well. Um, these are going out today, staying local here in the Ozarks. And if y'all fish the Ozark, the, especially the clear lakes up here, um, anywhere from Nebraska on down through Missouri and Arkansas, these rock crawlers. Now these are the originals. This is another one of those baits where some baits are really, really good when you get the knockoffs or the replicas, you would call them, and some just don't behave at all. A rock crawler, the stuff that they've pressed thus far that's not a rock crawler does not behave. It's not weighted the same, doesn't swim the same. So this is one of those baits where I always recommend that folks go with the original. And I won't, I won't even paint a knockoff. So these are the Spros, these RC55s. And uh, that's some of the signature stuff that I do. And wiggle warts, love the wiggle warts. Real good this time of year. Love that crackle pattern up there. And I would be remiss if I didn't give a shout out to Kurt. So I've been getting some, I don't know if you would call it fan mail, but um, definitely very, um, very cool folks in the airbrush community and, and the art community that are fishing oriented. And I just wanted to uh, say thank you, Kurt. I got some airbrush paint, which I've not used CS. I use their clear coat, but I have not used their, um, their paint. So he is a jig guy. He works at Sniper Jigs, so check him out if you see him online, if you see him on Facebook. Um, and we'll just go ahead and show you the little note that I got from him. This is what I use for moss green. It's a very popular color for Upper Potomac and Susquehanna, which is my stomping grounds. That's where I grew up. Um, so thank you, Kurt. Hope it works for you. Keep up with the, uh, the videos. They're helpful for us rookies. Um, thanks, Kurt Butts, Sniper Jigs. Hey, Kurt, thank you so much. Thank you so much for the gift. Um, and I'll try and I'll, I'll do you one even better. I'm going to try and use this in a pattern on a spray session, and uh, we'll, we'll see how it does. I'm pretty excited about this. So, hey, four ounces of moss green. Super stoked. Thank you so much, Kurt. This concludes the workshop update. It is Wednesday, September 26th. I will see you guys out on the water. Thanks so much for watching. Thanks for the support. I really, really appreciate it. You guys rock. See ya.